Making a video is so hard. <laughs> I'm always laughing, always laughing. Take all my mind, take all the joy now, take me down, take all the love now, tie me away, burn me alive now, break me down right now. Now you wanna lock me away, I'm winning, you wanna add to my pain. What's up beautiful people, it's your girl Jenny O and you're welcome to my channel. If you're new, if you are a returning subscriber, welcome back. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. Guys, in today's video, we will be talking about the second trimester. If you have not seen my first trimester video, please be sure to check it out. Today, we will be talking about the second trimester and everything that comes with it. What to expect. Yes, yes. Anyway, without further ado, let's dive into today's video. Okay, you guys, first things first, like I always say in my videos, this is not general. This is, I'm not generalizing anything. This is just my experience. As you can see, I am, yeah. <laughs> As you can see, I'm pregnant. So this is just my experience. I'm not generalizing nothing. Anyway, without further ado, let me go in. And if I'm looking down, I'm looking at a list I wrote because, yeah, I just don't want to forget anything. Anyway, first things first, in the... You know, in the beginning of the first trial of my second trimester, because I'm in now I'm in my third. I think I feel like I'm talking really fast. <laughs> anyway, now I am in my third trimester. So in the beginning of my second trimester, what I experienced, what I started experiencing was heartburn. Like, girl, when I say the heartburn, I mean the heartburn. <sighs> like it was severe like it was it was terrible i remember just and it causes me sleepless night like i remember staying up at night and just taking sips of cold milk or cold water anything cold or juice fruit juice just to you know cool <laughs> just to cool it down a little bit that's how burning it was it was really really burning guys it was really really burning and i think it's because you know i read somewhere that uh because of the baby growing blah 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 the the um, stomach is not really closing up really really well anymore so i guess that's that was why but anyways secondly was bloating yes i mentioned this in my first trimester video yes i know but it came with me <laughs> it also came into my second trimester and yes the bloating is real like you will feel so full so uncomfortable like you're not it's it's not as if you you over you you ate so much it's just filled with air and it leaves you burping and farting like crazy <laughs> Okay guys, I'm back and I'm sorry I had to cut the video because I was laughing like crazy and I didn't want to ruin it at all. <laughs> oh, I didn't want to bore you guys and I didn't want you guys to, you know, just stay there and watch me laugh for, for a good amount of time. But yeah, I'm back, I'm back. Anyway, the next thing was shortness of breath. Like, there are times where you will feel like you can't breathe. Yes yes girl mm -hmm. yes it happens happened to me may and it's still happening to me but yeah i will put that in the third trimester video yes there are a times where you will feel like you can't breathe like you are literally finding it difficult to grasp to just breathe air yeah that's how I was feeling. That's how I felt sometimes. Sometimes I'm like, whew, I can't breathe. And when, I, when I'm talking, especially when I'm talking to someone or, you know, if you have noticed my videos, you will also notice that, yes, it's real. The breathing thing is real. I can't breathe. But yeah, sometimes it's just normal. 
and then the next thing when you expect what to expect in your second trimester is that your baby bump will start growing yay <laughs> A lot of women love their baby bumps so much because they get to play with it, they get to experience it, they get to feel it. You know, it makes you it makes you realize that oh my god, I'm really pregnant. <laughs> yes, it gives you that wake up call that yes, it says you are definitely prego. Mhm. Mm and what comes next is that your clothes if you're as skinny as I used to be before, your clothes will not fit anymore. Mm -hmm. That's sad. But yeah, a lo lots of my clothes doesn't fit anymore except the, you know, the big ones that I have. And sometimes, sometimes what I do is I just go to my boyfriend's wardrobe and, you know, I just go shopping in his wardrobe <laughs> like what I'm wearing right now this is definitely his t-shirt because it's really loose and you know it gives me the space I need and it's, it's not so tight because if I wear my regular clothes they're so so tight now and some of them don't even fit anymore some of them are hanging somewhere here <laughs> and all the belly will be showing below yes that's how it is <laughs> okay you guys next on my list was discoloration mm -hmm. as you can see my foundation doesn't match my neck mm -hmm. discoloration as you can see you guys look at this Look at this, look at this. Okay, if I put my hand here, you can tell. And don't say it's the makeup. Okay, fine, I will insert a picture here of me. What's in my eye? So guys, I will insert a picture here. Yes, I cleaned my eye. I had to cut the video and clean my eye a little bit. I will insert a picture here of me on this day before I did my makeup me today wearing the same thing and everything without makeup on so you will see what i'm talking about yes the um it started it started as an allergic reaction it started as an allergic reaction and it got really really itchy and before you know it it started around this area like this and before you know it it started growing and growing and growing and i yeah I hate it <laughs> and I feel really really so and I feel really really insecure about it so yeah it started as, as an allergic reaction and during the summer guys my god during the summer it was really severe and when I sweat it burns especially at night it burns and it gets so itchy and I have actually bruised several times because I scratched too hard so I have you know scratched my skin I cannot okay yeah you can see this I don't know if you can see this right here it is from excessive scratching and also there are also tiny ones in there but I'm not sure you can see them on camera but yeah the bruise it's the itchy especially at night it's definitely nothing to write home about it was terrible and I hate it to be honest with you but anyway the good news is if you if you have a very tough first trimester where you get so sick where you get so nauseous where you get you couldn't you can't eat you can't do anything well the good news is apart from everything I've mentioned in this video the second trimester is the hyper trimester where you get so active, where you get so, you know, you feel alive again. <laughs> you feel so alive again. You get really active. You can move. You can do whatever you want. And sometimes you even forget you're pregnant. <laughs> yes it happens sometimes you even forget you're pregnant that is how wonderful the second trimester is and also last but not least you can finally start feel your baby kicking and moving around inside you that is also a wake-up call to let you know 
girl you are pregnant you are creating a little human inside you and it's it feels so amazing it feels you cannot trade that feeling for anything in the world i mean i can't so i'm sure you also can't that is just it about the second trimester the second trimester yes you can also get a little bit of you know difficulties because yeah you're pregnant you're creating a life and all the hormones are knocking you down and knocking you left right and center so yeah it gets crazy but also it also gets fun it's nothing like the first trimester where you get all ugh, all sicky and vomity and all yeah the second trimester is the hyper trimester where you get to move it and shake it and you know just enjoy it and feel that baby really really you know moving around inside you having fun as it as time goes I, I, I don't even know what to say I don't know how to explain it but it is priceless guys the feeling is priceless and I I just pray for every woman out there who wants kids to to get to experience this feeling to get to you know be a part of this wonderful creation be a part of this amazing thing that a god <laughs> that god um that god has made for us women to enjoy and you know yeah but every good thing like i said every good thing also comes you know with some side some kind of but yeah at the end of the day it's all worth it i think i mean why not right you're growing a human you're bringing someone into this world so yeah it's all worth it anyway guys that is all i have to say about the second trimester and yes please 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 stay tuned don't forget to like share subscribe if you haven't already and hit the bell notification so you will be notified anytime i upload a new video and also stay tuned for my third trimester video yes i am in my third trimester so stay tuned because i will be uploading and talking about everything about the third trimester the good the bad and the ugly yes like i always do Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to, you know, I already said it, like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you all in my next video. XO. <laughs>